This is Adam Be Live here with a quick tip and tutorial on all virus TI users where you can take out several um, use the, the outs of the virus TI and virus TI snow. The virus TI snow has less outputs um, than the virus TI desktop and the rest of the big brothers. So the virus TI and the big brothers have like around six, I think it is. Anyway, I'm going to show you real quick how you do this. Plug in the snow right here. Put in several MIDI clips I've already made and then you can use the outs and here they are right there so how do you get this you gotta configure it the initial let's say one let's put two and then this one initialized three and that's about it um, we're going to put in a preset patch here. I don't know what this is going to sound like. And then you come here, take out the instance that's number two, which is this one. And you're going to put instance number three. All right. So in instance number two, nothing is sounding, but we're going to put in something. Nothing is making noise because there is no sound. There it is. And then you have to hit in. And there you go. Now you take another audio channel. Virus TI. Put three in. So stop this one. Okay, and now we got that one going. Here we're going to put a pad. Sorry, my bad. Here, number three. Number two. Virus control. Okay, now I ran out of polyphony, so now number, channel number three is out of polyphony. Cause this one had this this patch, the intro, whatever, has too much sound. So let's go with snowfall. Let's see what that happens. <laughs>
So there you go. Now you have all three instances coming out of the virus TI. You have the in and outs, which is three right here, three outs. So basically I'm using now through the USB port, the three outputs of the virus TI snow. But you can do this with the virus TI two and the virus TI big brothers. You just have to put out how many outputs they come out and then you just channel them out through the audio. And then you can renderize these patches normally and they will renderize through here. Even though there's no sound coming out here, you just have to, let's say you want to put this in channel right here. Extend it out. And then your mini, come out over here, put this one in. This one is mini four. Four. And then this one is maybe five. You can name them what they are right now at the moment. And then these two channels will renderize. Even though the sound is not coming out through here, you're, you're sending the sound or you're sending the signal into these. So you can use them and you can put, I don't know, any effects inside here, let's say. Which one is number one? As this one, let me see. Let me just stop them all. Okay, let's say put a fill. If you want to renderize this, put this out. Individual channels, you have to go through here, all tracks, then you renderize them. Make a new folder, tutorial, put it in here. Wait. I did a mistake. You have to put the external. You gotta use this effect and route the outputs and inputs. So we'll render in real time because your access virus TI cannot render in real time. I mean, it cannot render like a VST. You, it needs to render in real time. Save and big 
go. This should be here. You know, maybe these because there's no sound coming out of these. This was a good tutorial on how to route your signals with your virus TI and virus TI snow through the USB outputs. Take care, have a good one, peace.